Hello everyone, Lily here. Welcome to my channel. And today I am doing day 19 of the 31 days of tarot for 2021, hosted by Ethne Dawn. I will post a link below to Ethne Dawn's webpage where she lists all the prompts for the challenge in January 2021. And today's question is, share which tarot deck gives you the heebie-jeebies. And hands down for me, it's the Divine Moon Tarot. And it's one of those things where it was an impulse purchase. I was traveling, I was visiting this shop and I wanted a souvenir tarot deck. And well, either the shop had things that I really wasn't interested in or that I already owned. And I fell back on buying the Divine Moon. Even though, you know, until then, I wouldn't have considered buying it. It gave me the creeps. It's still giving me the creeps and the heebie-jeebies. And, but at some point, since I owned the deck, I saw a 21-day um, challenge, I guess you could call it, where, you know, the every day you did something with a particular deck. And in this month, in that particular month, the deck that was featured and used was a Divine Moon. So I decided to jump in and work on this deck and getting familiar for, with it for 21 days. And I don't know, I, it's hard to describe what it is about this deck that is creepy. I mean, is it the yellow eyes? Is it the f different colors? Uh, I mean, you know what, the fish eating the leg, here it's, you know, several hands, it's, it's not images that you expect, and, you know, I don't know exactly how to describe it, but the thing is, is since that challenge, that deck is a really good reader for me, and, yeah. That's basically all I can say about it. It's, it's, uh, I don't, it's, it's weird. It's weird in a creepy way. And like, you know, this one here, I mean, showing dead fish and skeletons. So, but yeah, now that I'm looking at it, I think it's probably the yellow eyes that really makes this well, creepy. Sorry to use the same word over and over. So that's it for day 19. That's the only deck that really gives me the heebie-jeebies. Uh, as a rule, if I look at a deck beforehand, either through a flip through or a review on YouTube, if I if I you know if it's I find it's creepy or doesn't doesn't jive with me, I wouldn't buy it. To start with so. So I'll end this here, and I'll wish you a good day. Until next time.